I told you what I, what I knew and I told you what someone told me. Um, and that's the bottom line. I never lied to anyone. I only told you what I knew and what someone had told me. That is the bottom line. And from that, um, obviously the media have decided that uh, they're, they're the most amazing experts at investigations. And um, there's a reason why uh, detectives in Honolulu are some of the best in the world. Uh, I think I'd really appreciate it if we just let them do their job and uh, maybe we could get to the bottom of it. But, uh, you know, I think also um, what has been blown out of proportion a little bit is uh, that I was a victim and um, all of a sudden you're, you're putting all the blame on me. So. Um, I take full responsibility. If if I did do something wrong, I have no question, no no problem in the world in uh, owning up to uh, if I did do something wrong. But as I said, from about 11:06 to about 1:27 a.m., I have no memory in my brain. I have nothing. There's, I've been trying to, and overlooking and going backwards and forwards, and uh, there's just nothing. Um, and I, I can't tell you how frustrating that is because we all want to know the truth. We all want to get to the bottom of it. And, um, you know, it's, my headaches have only just gone uh, two days ago. Um, it's like someone stuck a knife in my eye and, uh, and it's, the, you know, what can I say? It's uh, something that I endured throughout that, that night and... Um, I appreciate everyone's support that has supported me. Um, I do read comments and uh, do see what everyone has, has said, um, only because I have a dear family. And, uh, you know, I think at the end of the day, um, you know, I was in a place having a nice dinner and having a nice night, and then I became a victim and uh and now um you know it's all been turned around